we're gonna make some crispy roasted potatoes. Uh, so what I'm gonna make them from that I enjoy, I like doing them with is bite. I'm gonna make bite-sized pieces of fingerling potatoes. So I have a bunch of them that are ready to go here. Uh, I have the oven set for 450 degrees, and believe me, that's what you want to do. Uh, you know, you'll see a lot of recipes for roasted potatoes, 325, 350, you know, that kind of thing. Now, you want 450, and you get some nice crispy potatoes. So I put some olive oil on them, and I'm going to put a spice mix. Now, you can use whatever spice mix you want, right? So, you know, whatever, whatever you feel like putting on. This happens to be a Turkish potato spice mix. Um, you want to put as much as it takes to get them nice and coated when they're when they're not taking anymore right if, if no more sticking it'll all end up in the bottom of the bowl so you know it's ready to stop you've got them all coated and then you're going to put them on a parchment lined pan just spread them out uh, i didn't put any salt on this and the reason is this particular spice blend has an adequate amount of salt in it but you're going to have to check that all right so that's all there is to it to getting this ready. I'm going to stick them in the 450 degree oven and it should take probably about 25 minutes for them to be done. So we'll be back. All right, so the potatoes are done. I left them in for closer to 30 minutes actually because they were getting nice and brown and they weren't in danger of burning. So here you go. You know, take a look at those. Nice and browned and crispy. And we'll give them a taste. Give a piece of one for a taste here. Take one of these. Look at I mean, look how nice they are. Mmm. Okay. I have a crunch to them. So it makes a really good seasonings all over them. They taste fantastic. They're all the way cooked through. So again. 450 degrees for, hey, at between 20 and 30 minutes, bite-sized pieces, nicely seasoned, and you get a wonderful kind of a crunchy potato. We'll see you next time.